Hey everybody, welcome to another jam video with Jackson Audio and Music Supply. I'm Chad, we're at jams, we're hanging out, we're talking about guitars, we're talking about gear. So, super excited. Uh, today we're highlighting Gretsch guitars. We're going to show you the two main series that we keep in stock and that we love. And then we're looking at Vox amplifiers, specifically the AC series. And so you can see the different models that they have to offer, how cool they are, how great the tone is. So if you're looking for like a nice tube amp, you can't go wrong with the Vox AC series. So let's check out this video. Hi, it's me, Kale Boy. It's been a while. Uh, today I am introducing the Gretsch Streamliner series and what I have in my hands at the moment is the Jet Junior and it's the limited edition with a P90 in the neck and these really show off the uh, the old Gretsch glittery sparkly finishes that they took off their drum series at the time and these are just great affordable guitars that just are nice in the hand and sound great uh, let's go to some sound clips What I have in my hands right now is a no the newest addition to the Streamliner series, the G2655. And if you notice, this is a relatively small body for a, the uh, a semi-hollow guitar. And this is sort of Gretsch's take on a Gibson ES339. Um, it's really comfortable to play while still getting a lot of that those great uh, semi-hollow tones that you you know come to joy if you listen to the blues and what have you. Um, and the newest. I guess additions to these specific models is these staple bar P90s, which are really old fashioned, and these delightful, I believe they call them radio style knobs. So if you like uh, your grandpa's old transistor radio, they basically just stole them off of that. In the factory, nonetheless. So let's get some sound bites to listen to how spanky these P90s are. I mean, they are just. Thank Thank you. 
get some good good string bender going on here. We could get some really nice country tones. So lastly, we have this used G2622. This is the full-sized, uh, I guess, cousin of the last guitar I was playing. And this is the older-fashioned version of it as well. Older-fashioned. It just doesn't have the, uh, the staple P90s. This has the Gretsch B2, BT2S pick, uh, humbucking pickup, um, similar to the bridge of the Jet Junior. Uh, and these are just, you can think of these as humbucking pickups with Gretsch uh, pickup covers on them. So they sound nice and balanced, because you get a little bit of that covered pickup tone with the, the metal kind of taking some of the magnetic capacitance down, while also getting, you know, open bobbins here. And they, uh, they sound quite nice, quite balanced. They're good for any sort of rock, blues, whatever you, you feel like doing, and they clean up surprisingly nice as well. So let me try working my volume pedal here. is always the nice quacky almost acoustic tone yeah so let's do some some more lead tones add a little more gain to it a little more dirt so let's try doing that These humbucking pickups in particular sound really good with a nice bout of get a nice fuzz pedal. I'm gonna try to just use two drives here and see if I can't push my amp enough to get some more of like a... any good humbucking uh, equipped guitar you can always get some really good driven Led Zeppelin tones you know anything from the 70s so let's double up our drives again and try to just do a little bit of like a As you 
second here. Great sustain. Yeah. And I would be remiss not to play something BB King oriented, but with our vaguely 335 body shape here. So, you know, if we do our, our, our blues progression again, let me roll my sort of If you have any further questions, feel free to come in the store and ask me personally. Uh, if not, a little too shy, you can always DM us on Facebook or Instagram or anywhere you can find our strange videos.